every day. Clicks. Groups of kids who can't talk to anyone but their friends, who stay together all the time. There are a lot of these cliques in schools, and almost all teens are part of one. There are smart kids, cheerleaders, girls who are always overly dressed up, and many more. Kids feel pressured to fit in because they think that they'll have friends by joining up. However, they often have to follow what other members of the group are doing, even if it means hurting others, or even themselves. Teens try to be cool by following what other people are doing, by wearing the coolest clothes, and by sticking with the crowd. This isn't necessary. There is a saying, do not try to fit in when you were born to stand out. Now, we've all probably wanted to be in or have a group. I've done it, I'm guilty. I was in a group last year. It didn't turn out well. It ended after a few months. The feelings were hurt and friendships were broken. That shouldn't have happened. This is what happens in cliques. What happens is people get hurt, people get angry, and then people get revenge. I don't want this to happen to you, and I don't think you do either. Trust me, it's not worth it. It's not worth getting hurt over a stupid fight because you were trying to be cool. We were not born for this. We were born to be ourselves. So how can you avoid these problems? Now, I'm not going to tell you to just ignore it. It's everywhere. But the first step is to not let your friends talk you into doing things. If they want to join a group, tell them that you're not comfortable doing so. And they might change their mind, but it's not your job to make them do so. The second step is to not be afraid to back out or disagree. Peer pressure will dig under your skin. Don't let, it, don't let yourself get tied up in it. Just because everyone else is doing something doesn't mean you have to, too. And step three, be yourself. Don't let anyone tell you who you are or what to do. You are your own person, and you should be proud of that. Show it. Thank you.